Moose Knuckles lose by 43 to the Reefer Sticks in the blowout of the week. With 73 points this week and 82 last week, the Moose Knuckles have stumbled out of the gate and appear to have made bad decisions at every turn in the draft. Be a judgment. The Reefer Sticks got big games out of Adam Thielen and Ben Rapisberger. Rapisberger, Rapisberger. The two almost scored enough to beat the Moose Knuckles all on their own. But I'm not alone at the bottom. Our defending champion Finger Puppet Mafia drops to 0-2 as they lose to the Goblins, who got very good games from Kirk Cousins and A.J. Green. And that's all I had to say about that. Red Eye's Revenge came back down to earth after a huge week one. I always call it massive. Sometimes they say huge. They lost to the 2-0 Coleys, who were also leading in the points race. I wouldn't worry about that little guy. Good enough for me. You're my man now. The other team at 2-0 is the Dude Abides. They beat the Skins in a tough matchup. The Skins left Pat Mahomes and his 38 points on the bench. The Skins have to feel like they let one get away and the better team lost this game. Yeah, well, you know, that's just like uh, your opinion, man. But the marquee matchup of the week was Vanilla Gorilla vs. Money Inc. Gorilla was talking a lot of shit during the preseason. And with his win over the Reefer Sticks in week one, some were thinking he might be able to back it up. Well, let's not start sucking each other's dicks quite yet. But Gorilla didn't seem to have the fire he showed in week one. And Money Inc., behind Stefan Diggs, gets his first win of the season and joins a mess of teams at one and one. We know that this is your homework. I'm gonna cut your dick off, Larry. You're killing your father, Larry. 